Hey guys, so I know I look like extremely ratchet right now, but I wanted to show you some books that I've gotten recently. Well, not recently, I got them today. Um, so I just wanted to show you and say hi, because I'm in a good mood. I'm supposed to be editing right now, but I'm going to go through my books and maybe bring some back. But the first one that I got today is Never Always Sometimes by Adia Alsed. I'm not sure how you say the name. Um, it's a YA book. I know that. Um, not sure 100% what it's about, but I've heard that it's really good and there's been some good reviews, so I decided to pick it up. The next one I got was Jesse's Girl by Miranda Kenley, or Kennelly. I'm not sure how you say that name either, but this is another one from the YA section that I've heard a lot about and great things about, and I know her Catching Jordan, I believe the Catching Jordan, that is a series, right? If you guys know, let me know, because I believe this is totally different, but I've heard really, really amazing things about this book, and so I decided to pick it up, because I could use a little love in my life. The next one I got is Nightmares by Jason Siegel and Kristen Miller. Hey, it is the people I saw. I don't know Kristen Miller, but Jason Segal is the actor, and it looks really cool. It's kind of thick to be a kid's book, but it has really cool deckled edges and really cool chapter headings, um, but it sounds really, really awesome and fun, so I got that one. The next one I got is Reconstructing Amelia by Kimberly McCret or Ms. McCreet. I'm not sure exactly how you say it. Yet again, deckled edges. This is an adult book. Um... I believe this is about um, a dead person, I think, because it just says her daughter Amelia is dead. Not 100% sure, but I know when I did read it a long time ago that it sounded really, really good, and so I decided to pick it up. I think I heard this from Richard Denny, but I'm not entirely sure. I could be totally off. Then the next one I got is one I normally wouldn't pick up, even though I do own all of her books, um, but it's Seen Anything by Sarah Dessen. I have not read a single book by her, and so I thought I would pick this up and maybe start with this one, since this is her most recent one, and I've heard, like, incredible things about this. If this is not the book I should start with, let me know, and let me know what I should start with. Um, but I, I should just pick it up and get it. It looks like it's pretty big writing. Um, it is a pretty thick book, but I'm thinking I can probably get through it pretty quickly. Um, let me know your thoughts on this, if you've read it. Then the last... Um, big book I got, this is also an adult novel, and it is You by Caroline Kepnes. Kepnes? I have no clue. But I've heard amazing reviews about this, and this is a horror book, I believe, or a thriller or something. Um, it has very big writing to be an adult book, so I'm probably going to get through this quickly because it sounds really good, and like I said, every single review that I've seen of this has been literally amazing, so I'm excited to get to this one. The back just has a little paragraph, and it says, you're going to be sorry when you realize what you made me do. The good news is that I have no regrets. Uh -oh. Sounds amazing. And then the last book I have right here, I've actually already read, obviously, um, and it is What Pet Should I Get by Dr. Seuss, which is the newest Dr. Seuss book. I love Dr. Seuss. I have a lot of his books. And this one was good as well. I did not like the ending. I understand the ending. I understand why they did what they did. But I don't like it. Um, it seemed like they... I don't... I didn't read, like, the full bio on him. But it seemed like they kind of just... He had a little, like, bits of a book that he wanted. And they just kind of packed it all together looking to try to be like Dr. Seuss. Um, but it was a good book. It stuck with Dr. Seuss's theme, so that was good. And, yeah, so and here's everybody. <laughs> but that's everything. If you have any questions, comments, anything, leave them down below. If you've read any of these, let me know what you think about them. I'd love to hear, what, hear your thoughts about it, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.